The James Webb Space Telescope was sent into orbit six months ago by a European rocket. Since then, the very complicated telescope has successfully unfolded its large sun shield, turned on its scientific equipment, and traveled more than a million kilometers away from Earth. The images are being taken right now, according to Thomas Zerbrücken, who oversees NASA's scientific projects, during a news conference on Wednesday. We are in the process of putting the history-making data down. He said, there's already some fantastic science in the can, and some others are yet to be taken as we move forward, he added. NASA aims to release numerous photos as a consequence of Webb's first light observations beginning at 10.30 a.m. Eastern Time, or 14.30 UTC, on July 12th. According to space agency officials, the images and data will include the deepest field of view of the universe ever taken, looking deeper into the cosmos than humans have ever done before, as well as the spectrum of an exoplanet's atmosphere. By contrast, Webb will be able to recognize the fingerprints of any tiny chemicals, like carbon dioxide and ozone, by examining them in the infrared, which will provide crucial indications about the habitability of worlds near other stars. Pam Melroy, NASA's deputy administrator, was astounded by the photographs Webb has provided thus far. What I saw moved me as a scientist, engineer, and human being, she remarked. Zerbrücken recalled his initial experience with Webb data and expressed his own astonishment at what the telescope had shown capable of. When he saw the first images taken by the new device, he almost sobbed. It's really hard not to look at the universe in a new light, and not just have a moment that is deeply personal, he said. It's an emotional moment when you see nature suddenly releasing some of its secrets, and I would like you to imagine and look forward to that. Sadly, the results of Webb's initial observations won't be out for another nearly two weeks. Even under an embargo, NASA stated that it would not be releasing any photographs beforehand. However, it took 20 years for Webb to become operational and provide a genuinely deserving replacement for the Hubble Space Telescope. I guess we can hold out for a bit longer. If you want to learn more about the James Webb Space Telescope and stay up to date, subscribe to the channel to receive our daily updates. Thanks for watching.